Good morning, welcome back to the channel. My name is Keith. I'm down here at the H10 Las Palmeras in Las Americas, just beside the patch on the beautiful island of Tenerife. So, let's do a quick wander around. I've passed this hotel, I've got an no idea, it must be a hundred and more, hundreds of times, uh, on my way to and from the Golden Mile. And you're only about five, ten minute walk, not even that from the Golden Mile. And I never realised how big it was. I never came in. So this is a first for me. Uh, four star hotel. And it's smack bang in the middle of you've got you have the Golden Mile on one side of you and you have the Veronica's on the opposite side. So absolutely fantastic location. Uh, I would if I was looking for a room, right, if you look to the left here is the quiet is the noise around i'd be going to the right hand side of this building if i was looking for a room just to keep the noise levels down uh dubliners bar is not far from here and is open till four o'clock in the morning and i know that from experience because i've fallen out of it more than one occasion at four o'clock in the morning and not my fault i blame a certain englishman uh who also vlogs on the island and he has a tendency to uh, lead people astray and then he blames people for leading him astray. Everyone knows who he is. I don't need to name and shame. But anyway, in my experience, this area can be a little bit noisy on the right side. Left side, I would say not so much. But uh, just, yeah, if you're, if you're staying here, ask for a quiet room or just to give yourself the chance, I would go this side. Pool view will probably give you a better better chance of a quiet room and definitely on the left side of this part of the building grounds in here are absolutely beautiful you've got a little coffee dock over there in a bar and I say the grounds are beautifully maintained now again H10 the H10 group of hotels I've stayed in a couple of them and they are a fantastic hotel there's no question with that now, as you can see, plenty of entertainment for both adults and children. Your bar and your restaurant are over there. And you, you find this sort of mixed tile theme is kind of common in a lot of the H10s. And what else have we got? a gym again if that's your thing let's not disturb people who are training and you have a soft play area for children there as well as soon as the weather is bad which very rarely it is but if you wanted to get them in out of the heat you have a little spa reflexology there so quite a few things within the hotel to keep you occupied on a cloudy day it's very rarely you get a rainy day here Now, communal area is spotlessly clean. The piano bar there and your reception. Car rental and excursion on site. And another little bar up there in the corner. Look, you can't go wrong with H10. They really are a fantastic chain of hotels. And as you can see, location wise, you can't fault. If you walk out to your left, you've got the Veronica's about 200 yards that way. And this is what I was saying to you if I was booking a room, I'd be looking for one at the back, not in this block. Because this book is going to hear the Gaelic Corner, there's no question about it. Uh, Gaelic Corner and the Dubliner are two fantastic venues and well worth it. Just nice, good crack, bit of laugh, and you just won't have a bad night. Great live music in it, and downstairs the same, they've live music till, as I said, 3 4 o'clock in the morning. So, this is the patch area. 
So if you're staying in that in the H10, that's from Ellis, you have a lot to see, a lot to, there's a lot around here, and the Golden Mile is roughly five, six minute walk from here. So location wise, 10 out of 10. Beach down below, you just can't go wrong. Now these bars here are closed for renovation at the moment. Quite a few of them did issues with uh, with concrete peeling away. So quite a few of the bars around here have been closed down. But not these. Daniel's I think is still open. Sugar and spice, potatoes. So say you've got a good selection of, of restaurants and bars around here. They're actually down that little walkway. If you walk down that little lane, there's a surf club down the end of that, and there's also. Uh, Kev Chillow Bar, which is actually a great little spot if you want karaoke for the night. So, yeah, it's a good little spot. So, I'll leave you at that. If you like what you see, hit the like, subscribe, bell for notification. Oh, and for all of you who've asked the question, what do I say at the end? I do say good boy, but I also say slon. Slon's Irish for good boy. I always just throw it in at the end. So, like, subscribe, bell for notification, give me a share put it out and I'll talk to you in the next one. Take care. Salon. So